Donkey of the day for Tuesday, March 5th, goes to San Francisco Giants CEO Larry Bear. Now, Larry is taking a leave of absence after video surfaced of him last week looking not like the CEO of the San Francisco Giants, but more like an employee of the WWE. In fact, this wasn't even WWE-like. This was more like a high school wrestler. Okay, what I saw was a double-leg takedown on a woman that was already sitting down. Yes, Larry Bear clearly has a high school wrestling background because last week he found himself in a predicament that no man wants to be in. But it's a predicament that us faithful black males don't ever have to worry about. Drop one of clues bombs for us, damn it. Okay. Trust me, when I saw Larry Bear in this video, I felt his pain because I know that feeling. Okay, you know the feeling when you are an unfaithful man. I was once that. Okay, you cheating on your wife or significant other. You're out here just putting your penis in places it has no business being. Okay? So what's the one thing you must protect when you are living like this? What do you think, Yee? Uh, your phone. Well, the obvious answer would be yourself. Wear a condom, okay? <laughs> but but no. The one thing that must be protected at all costs, you're right, Yee, is your cell phone. All right? Now, let's be clear. Smartphones are addictive, okay? They are designed that way, so it's very hard not to have your phone in your hand at all times. But it's the difference between being addicted to your smartphone and keeping your smartphone on you at all times because you know you're doing dirt. Okay, salute to the man I used to be because a lot of y'all, including Larry Bear, are still that guy right now. You are the man who is scared to death to leave your phone anywhere around your mm -hmm. wife or significant other. Oh, you take the phone into the bathroom. Not to do a number two because that's appropriate, but to take a shower. Why is that? Okay, I'll, I'll tell you why. It's because you're afraid that your woman will go through it. All right? Are you af you're afraid you're going to get a nude or an inappropriate text from your mm -hmm. little side boo. All right? Lord have mercy. I don't envy y'all. See, black men don't Don't put cheat. my name in it, bro. <laughs> Nowhere near my name in it. I don't envy Don't envy me. Don't DJ nothing. <laughs> don't entrepreneur, real estate, nothing. Nothing concerning with me when you're talking about this. And you you know, shut up, Envy, because black men don't cheat. And All you right. know how All horrified right? people are when they get their messages <laughs> on their iPad or on their my computer? Name. Jeez. <laughs> Envy, relax, Tell okay? Me. You're, uh, we know you're a proud member of the faithful black male community. Hey, All right, you can leave your phone around your wife anywhere at any time. Face up! That's right. With no screen protector. There you go. Okay? You can have my passcode, baby, mm -hmm. because I'm clean. All right? It's a freeing feeling. All right? I cannot believe you unfaithful men are out there imprisoning yourself by still being infidels. Now, I don't know if Larry Bear was cheating on his woman, right? Yes, you I'm, do. Just, I'm just using context clues, all right? If you are watching Revolt TV, we are about to play the video, but I will describe what happened. Larry Bear's wife, Pam Bear, said in a statement she had taken her husband's phone, and when he tried to take it from her, Ooh. the chair she was sitting on tipped over, and a previous foot injury prevented her from regaining her balance. It's like a UFC battle. <laughs> exactly. No need for me to discuss it anymore. Let's go to CBS News for the official report. San Francisco Giants president and CEO Larry Bear is taking a leave of absence from the team. The decision comes after a video surfaced showing him engaged in a physical altercation with his wife. The video posted on TMZ Friday caught Bear's wife toppling to the ground after he reached for a cell phone in her hand. In a statement Monday, the Giants board of directors said it granted Bear his request for personal time away as Major League Baseball heads the investigation into the incident. Bear and his wife issued a statement Friday saying they regretted having a quote heated argument in public. He has issued an apology for the incident. Who are you apologizing to? The only person you should be apologizing to is your wife. Well, maybe mm -hmm. he was trying to plan a surprise party for her and then the information was in the phone. And he maybe. <laughs> Thank you, Yee. I like that one. That's a okay, good excuse. That's a good excuse. That's a good, I got that you a gift and you just ruined it. Right. But he could have helped her up off the floor after she fell. He, he didn't even pick her up. He, picked, he got his phone. She can't see where the location was going to be. Through his the phone so far. Well, here's the reality of the situation. Only a man who had something to hide would put his wife in a snap down takedown to retrieve his cell phone from her, okay? <laughs> Only a man who was not a proud member of the faithful black male community would put his wife in the body fold takedown just to get his phone I don't back. know if he could be a member of the faithful black male community. No, 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 no. He's not even a member of the faithful male community, though. But the reason he's not even a faithful male because he's not a black man. But that's another story. Uh, my brothers, <laughs> let me give you a tip from my cheating days. If your wife has your phone, the last thing you should do is react. Don't raise your voice. Don't get hostile. Don't try to snatch your phone back. Simply remain calm and tell her, go ahead. Look through it. When she sees you act like that, she won't even have any desire to go through your phone. Yeah, right. <laughs> That's terrible advice. But when you go crazy, <laughs> yeah, I, all right, and she's still looking. He knew, he knew it was on there. 
<laughs> I'm just saying, when you go crazy and react like Larry Bear acted, then your wife is going to act crazy, too. He got the phone, though. <laughs> <laughs> We now we don't know what's on it now. He got the phone. She all don't I'm, know what's on it either. All I'm saying is we don't need crazy <laughs> reacting to crazy because then crazy has escalated and you're all over the news now for putting your wife in the Cobra clutch. Who needs that? Okay. Larry Barrett, please understand that if you truly love someone, being faithful is easy. Okay. And it brings you great joy. And peace of mind. Mm-hmm. Do you feel peaceful this morning? Very Andy? peaceful. You look peaceful. Brother. I'm peaceful, brother. You look peaceful. I'm so peaceful, brother. <sighs> please, uh, I gotta hit. Like Larry Bear, gotta let. Please let Remy. Yeah, let Remy Ma give Larry Bear the biggest hee-haw, Please. Hee-haw. Yeah. Hee-haw. You stupid motherfucker. Are you dumb? I had to think what hee-haw I wanted to give him. I started to get hit him with the Hamilton. But I'm like, no. This is a Remy Ma type level offense. Mm. Yeah. You know that if your eyes are closed and say you're asleep. If you have the face recognition, somebody could still open your phone. Fine, do it. I'm yeah, just telling yeah. you. You can do that for me. I just found that out on lip service, that's all. I'm clean out here. I'm cl- clean as a whistle. Been clean for two years and uh, five months now. Yes. And I don't even need to do that. My wife got all the passwords. You can go anytime she wants. Yeah. Yeah, phone's up. I don't it's care. peaceful, peaceful over peaceful! here. Peaceful! Air so fresh over here in this so faithful fresh. black male community. That's right. Do they know about the phones y'all leave up here that you don't bring home? That ain't true. That's definitely the not devil true. is a liar. Don't play with me. The devil and Angela is a whole damn liar. A whole liar. <laughs> that ain't even remotely true. Damn. All right, I'm kidding. Now, damn. You ain't even got to say you're kidding. God know the truth. Yeah, God know the truth. <laughs> God and my wife know the truth. That's right.